Hey, babe, you want to struggle? Sure. Yeah, we're here every kitchen mechanics night. Do you like to dance? That look into my eyes, crap, didn't get over with him. <laughs> well, it got over with you. Why just me to dance? You know Pauline wanted to dance. I already with danced with her. With chicks just like her, I wanted to dance with you. Mm. That's better. How long you been up in New York? Five months. From? Hertford. Hertford, North Carolina. Carolina? Mm -hmm. so how you like it up there? I like it. It's big and you could drop dead and nobody would care. But here there are all these different people doing different things it makes me think maybe I could do something different too. Yeah, like what? I don't know. Not housework though. At home, you're lucky if you got any job. But here, you know, I think maybe I got more of a choice. See all these women here? They all work in some old phase kitchen. And a lot of the fellas here ain't got no job at all. Hey, you never heard of the Depression? You never heard of if you're white, you're all right, and if you're black, get back? You don't work for no white folks. Girl, I could just... It's easy to be driving some white men's car. Yeah, you can do a little something for yourself, but just wanting it don't make it so. Unless you want it bad enough. <laughs> Oh, well, I guess I'll see you next week at the Savoy at your Walter. place, Walter. Right, good, night. good night. Come on, Esther. Come on, Esther. Good night. When am I going to see you again? You, uh, you off Sunday? Yeah. Well, do you have any plans? Um, well, we're going to the Savoy early around 5. What if I meet you there? Okay. See you Sunday. Bye. Esther. You slay me. Can't hear in 20 minutes. Like the West Indians say, I gone. Hey, you looking for somebody? Hi. It's kind of dead in here. Why don't you let me feed you? Come on. No, uh uh. No. I brought Dorothy and Pauline with me. How come girls always travel in packs like rats? Because I was afraid you wouldn't go show up. Besides, it wouldn't be nice to leave. Hey, oh, did you really think I wasn't going to show up? I believe in being prepared for the worst. Oh, it's from the girl who was coming to New York to do all these different things. Oh, you think that's funny? Come on, sit down. Sit down. I think any time you want something and you go after it, that's great. So what you going to do? Oh, you don't think this is stupid. Try me. Well, okay. See, I play the number every day, every week, and if I ever hit, I'm gonna be something just like you, except I'm a beauty shop. Because I used to do everybody's hair at home. I got a real flair for it. Maybe I could help you. How? Maybe I know a lady who owns a beauty shop. I could call her up, tell her to give you a job, you know, a shampoo girl, teach you how to do those heads. I mean, you just call this lady up and she'll give me a job just like that? Mm -hmm. And you're not afraid this lady will get jealous? Oh, Lorraine's not really like that. Besides, she's my sister. <laughs> I think that's all. all right, Miss Johnson. You just step right over here. 
the shampoo bottle. I thought she got married. She's saying she did. Claims he's with Count Basic. The way she looks more like Count Dracula to me. She not doing so hot, huh? Oh, honey, she looks so bad. All she have to do is close her eyes, she be dead. Good afternoon, ladies. Anything for me this afternoon? You know I do. Oh, girl, you old faithful. I meant anything else. I want to combinate on 168 for 10 cents. 168, that sounds familiar. Ah, uh, too. Last three numbers of Walter's Cafe address. I don't want to place 10 cents straight on 739. No, make that 40 cents. What you doing here? I couldn't take that woman and her uniform no more. You lose your job? Mm-hmm. Mm. Well, what you gonna do? I don't know, find another one or maybe retire to Florida. <laughs> You know of anything? Yeah. So where is everybody? Your mama went shopping. Alone at last. Boy, quit. And watch where you're walking. That's your scrub there. Oh, Alice, I like you. I really like you. What would you do if your mama was on the other side of that door listening to you right now? Probably die. I don't know why you keep bothering me. Because I like you. And it doesn't matter that you're colored. Not much, you don't. I'm light. So do you, that makes me better. Still colored, but better. A lot of colored people think that way too, Paul. But I don't. Alice, I... I got a man. He's black as your shoe. He's good and handsome, and I love him. If I had to choose between him or anybody else, anybody, I'd choose him. Now I gotta flow to scrub before your mama gets home. It. Do the same thing underneath that curl. Do both sides. That way it'll last longer. Okay. And it's got to last me. Don't know when I'm going to get back in. Getting ready for the season opener at Saratoga. You going up there again? Yeah, girl, and you sure too. There's no color view to shop anywhere near there. What am I supposed to do with this place while I go traipsing up there? Oh, let your operator take care of the shop. You're only going to be gone a couple of months, and you can make lots of money. Ow! Ooh. God, Ooh. careful. Sorry, Miss Brown. How much you going to pay me to let this woman practice in my head? She could pay better attention to what she's doing if you keep still about your big money dream. Last season, I made $1,540, and that ain't no green. And this season, I'm going to do even better. When that racetrack opens, there is a flood of tourists and gamblers. And with the prostitutes and the maids and no colored beauty shop, you can just watch that money rolling in. I'm doing all right here. All right, but you can make one, maybe $2,000 in a few months that the racetrack is open. Ow! You're doing real good, Esther. But you gotta pay attention. I'm real sorry. Esther! 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 Esther, did you hear? Did you see the paper last night? No. Esther, seven, three, nine, hit! Seven, oh! three, nine, hit, Esther! Oh, oh, you oh, rich! Wait a minute, wait a minute. It's not my number. Yes, it is, Esther! I didn't... Esther, you played that number the other day with me for 40 cents. Not my number. Esther, right now, you got yourself two hundred dollars coming. <laughs> Ain't nothing beats having a rich old lady. Seppin' is having a rich youngin'. Yeah. Hallelujah! We're gonna go out and celebrate tonight. And I mean really celebrate. So I wonder what rents are like. How much you think it would cost to get a place up there? I don't know. <laughs> I thought I caught the smell of cooking grease turnip. Probably your top lip, my man. <laughs> this here is Calvin, and we have been going at each other since, since forever. You gotta be S 